recording, yes it is. Quarantine! Hi Spuds! Now I don't know about you, but when I think about Limb Biscuit, I think of this. What I don't think of is pussy hole, never made a tootsie roll, give a shit, clean up in this bitch just like a bag of gold. Oh my god, it's that white rapper guy, that white Leo telling everybody Gemini. So that's cool. Uh, Fred Durst, you need to lay off the fucking drugs and make some real music. Some of you might know that Limp Bizkit have a new album or a new... Uh, something. It's only going to be available on cassette, apparently. For those people who don't know what a cassette tape is, uh, Google it. Because, fuck. You should probably know what a fucking cassette tape is. Jesus. Look, to be honest, CDs are pretty outdated these days, let alone a fucking cassette tape. But that's not what I wanted to focus on with this video. My childhood's ruined. My teenage years are over. Well and truly over. And just when I have this small little hope that Limp Bizkit are making a new album and that it's gonna rekindle my love for them and bring back such nostalgia, BAM! All my hopes and dreams come crashing down with that nonsense. Ugh, pick up your game, Limp Bizkit. Like, holy shit, there's people here that are fucking counting on you to be good and uh, if, if you gain new fans and stuff from this then fucking good luck to you because that's it. That's me. I'm out. Limp Bizkit for me growing up was like one of my badass bands that I used to be into along with Korn and Eminem and Blink-182. They were like my top four. For Limp Bizkit to bring out this abomination of a <coughs> song with such amazing lyrics. Oh man, I don't I don't want to live on this planet anymore. Fred Durst, what are you doing, man? Like are, are you trying to scare us all into being fans of you or something? Have you been watching too many Lady Gaga film clips because that's the vibe I get. I'm confused. Is it supposed to be funny? Cuz if so, <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, joke's over, man. Bring out the real music. I'm gonna go and listen to some uh, chocolate starfish in the hot dog flavored water because that shit's my jam. And in case none of you know what I'm talking about, I'll link a video to this song in the my tits. Comment down below what you think. Like, if you're old like me and you liked Limp Biscuit back when they were cool, give this video a thumbs up. If you're not old enough to remember who Limp Biscuit are, then cool. Welcome to my world. Woo! And before I go, I'm gonna give a humongous, humongous, giant, fantabulous shout out to one of my favorite small YouTubers. His name is Ben Blue. His link will be right here. And I'll also put it in the description so that you can check him out. He's fucking hilarious. I have been watching him for the good part of today, which is the night time, of course. And I've been annoying my husband by laughing my ass off very loudly next to him. So that's usually a good indication that someone is an awesome YouTuber. So go over there, subscribe, tell him I sent you, and have a fantastic day day, night, whatever the fuck is you are in the world. So that's it from me. Uh, thank you for watching. I love you all so much and I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I am so amazing. <gasps> oh. That's it from me. I love you all so much. So yeah. This is the first episode where I pretty much react to cringy videos. I've never seen any of these videos before in my life. I don't even know what I'm about to watch.